my God, I love you so much. Like any other parent, the Brad and Judy's social media feed is now owned by Baby Love. It's a peek into their life at home with True Legend. But for the full view, the two moms took us on a tour, starting with what they call their mommy and me room. Can I see your room, true legend? Oh, it's beautiful. This looks like heaven. Oh my God. This is the room. This is the mommy and me room. Oh my God. So it was real intentional that we had our bed to look like his crib. Uh oh, somebody wants mommy. Okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, let me get him. Let me get him. I'm in the middle. Oh, 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 oh. Hey, he got a bit of foam. He probably wants a bottle. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay, okay. He come like on. a bottle and he like okay. his water. I love seeing this come part. On, come on, it's okay. It's okay. I got the water you. Go. You mean put the water on? <laughs> yeah, put the water on. That's his favorite. I could watch there's this all day. There's your water. Look. <gasps> there's your what water. There's your water. Let okay. me explain. There's your water. What is this? So when we were in the hospital and the nurse cut the water on when she was doing things with him, it calmed him down. So we noticed that he liked water, so I made sure to add this element to the room. And it worked. Yeah. OK, that might be the new it thing to have in a baby room. <laughs> yeah, he likes it. How is he sleeping through the night? Um, I think he wakes up like twice, but I think he, he wakes up about four times still. <laughs> she said twice. She said four times. Because I let her sleep. Wow. And what time does he wake up usually? Um, when he wants. <laughs> is really? this the family room? You're um, in the bed in here, and yeah, so you so can get to him quickly? It's our room. Our room. So it's, yeah, yeah, it's so the she... mommy and me room. Oh. Yeah, because we can't be away from him. Oh. Right, so he hasn't slept in his bed He's yet. never slept in his bed. Yeah. He's, He's never slept in his bed yet? No. <laughs> or his bassinet. No. He just sleeps with us. He sleeps Judy, with us. Judy, you have children. <laughs> Did you do this before? No, but I was also a teenager, yeah. and I had a bunk bed, so my, my baby slept next to me yeah. in the bunk bed. So this so time around, you have a king-size bed, and the baby is still sleeping with you. Yeah. Tell me the first night he came home. I cried all night. <laughs> you cried through the whole pregnancy. Every time, yeah, I was very emo. Um, yeah. Every every time I looked at him, I cried, because I, I couldn't believe that he came from me. It felt special to me, because I felt like, this time around is different. I do have three children, but this is the time I'm, I'm co-parenting together with somebody. Oh, and look at him, how comforting. So tell me about this name, True Legend. Well, I, I, I wanted to call him Legend for a long time, because I said if we had a girl, I wanted to name her Legacy, and if we had a boy, I wanted to name him Legend. And just as the brat was getting to the good part behind the name True Legend, True Legend had to have his say. You better tell him. So I just, you know, I thought Legend was cool, and then I asked her, she loved it, but she said we should put something in front of it. So we just trying to figure out mm -hmm. what to make the first part so it wasn't just Legend. And one day she was like, oh, true Legend. And I was like, oh, I loved it. You love your name? Your name is True Legend. Can you believe it? Okay. Let's go, let's right. go. So how has the house changed other than the nursery? Because you, I'm soon enough at the rate he's standing up, you're gonna have to start childproofing things. Right. And is this the famous closet I've been told about? Let me. See. Oh, you were told about it. Oh, closet? I heard. I heard <laughs> from it's the a, word on the streets. Okay. It's just basic. We just wanted to make sure that he had uh, options <laughs> <laughs> for, for the many nights on the town he's had. Yeah. Baby, oh, Judy, tell me about his closet. So we have the clothes segmented by size. So we have size all the way to like two, three T. Excuse me. And the sneakers. So. Hi. Yeah, he has a mini sneaker collection. <laughs> that had nothing to do with me. That's all beautiful. This book is my son's favorite. This will become the hit in your home. Really? This was my son's favorite book until he was about two years old. Oh, You'll, wow. He, it was actually the first book he memorized. OK. Oh, wow. So, this, oh, you've got two copies. You're going to, and chicka, oh, you got all the hits. Chicka, chicka, boom, boom. Yeah. OK. Yeah, no. Llama, oh. llama, red pajama. Yeah. These are, so, like, this is like the greatest hits from, of all your songs right oh, here good. for babies. OK. After the Mommy and Me tour, it was time to get back to business. Literally, the brat wanted us to see where she makes her music and why it's such an inspiring room. And that gave me a chance to spend some time with Judy to find out how this beautiful blended family is working, a family that includes three children of her own. 
he uh, he did come over the other day and was holding him and he started crying, but I think it's because my dad, my the baby represent, uh, resembles my dad a lot. Really? He looks just like my daddy. Yeah, and he's passed away, so it just makes me feel like he, he's saying that I'm still here with you. That's got to... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I try not to talk about it too much because I get really emotional, but yeah. It's beautiful. So now we're entering to what room? This is Brad's studio. Yeah. Beautiful. Hi. Knock, knock. Friends are here. <laughs> this, is, oh, this is beautiful. Oh, I'm looking at all of these pictures. Yeah. Just the stages, the stages of the no. evolution, the journey. Yeah. So we'll... Um, True legend, spend time in here eventually? Uh, whatever he wants to do, he's going to support. <laughs> if he wants to play music, I, I play the drums, I play keyboard, whatever he wants to do, I'll help him do it. You know, engineering, whatever. Record, he can record a song. Okay, well, you know, Blue Ivy performed with Beyonce. I know. Madonna's daughter just I performed. Know. Drake's son. Yeah. We need to get some tracks. Oh, don't for you worry. True legend. Don't you worry now. <laughs> don't you worry. Have we you started done. recording the cooing and all that? The yes. That laughter with his favorite toy? I did. Come on. I did. Gotta, gonna you gotta show Drake. You gotta him. show Drake and Adonis. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna make something special for him. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. With him on it. You're going to make something? Absolutely. Like, being an artist, you want to do that. You know, you want to create special moments, especially with your kids. So, When we come back, how the brat and Judy are leaning in on one special friend to help them out. Okay. Look, everybody. Uh, hi. Uh, you have uh, six yeah. dogs, a newborn, <laughs> and you're still sane. Yeah. <laughs> And a big reason for their sanity, the Brad and Judy say, is family friend Anaya Buchanan, who's instrumental to their day-to-day -day lives. <laughs> Look at that smile. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm going to take it away, OK? I'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> what is it like to see them? You're part of the tribe. You're yeah. part of the, the village here. You know, like, sometimes <laughs> I really have to just sit back and just be like, oh, like, just take it all in. It's just seeing so much love in one's face. Like, he is one blessed baby, but they're blessed as well because he's so special. What is it like? You met um, Judy four years ago at church, mm -hmm. had a connection. Mm -hmm. Brad comes into the family, mm -hmm. now true legend. What is it like? like helping them on this journey it's undescribable like mm -hmm. i tell them all the time like it's just such a blessing like just to be able to you know see him like from now he's like every time even if i go you know one day without seeing him i come back he's doing something special mm -hmm. doing something new i'm like when did he start doing that <laughs> she prayed with us before i went to have the ivf we yeah. called her because yeah. she's a prayer warrior and stuff. So we yeah. called her to come pray, and we waited for her to get there, and we all prayed together before I went to get my uh, the, the second embryo, yeah. the second embryo wow. transfer. Yeah. You know, now people are going to start calling you to pray. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> come and have this baby. <laughs> and you are also kind of responsible for, I, I need to understand, one, two, <laughs> three, four, five. There, there's a scooter. There's a... This is my personal favorite. You already put in this poor baby the vacuum work in this big mansion. He loves the the toys. He has all the toys. You should hear his mama he say that. He has four pacifiers just here alone. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> but I'm telling you, sometimes one work and the other one don't. Do you look at the three of them in awe? I do. Yeah. I do. And it, it makes you just, it makes you really grateful, but it makes you really see, like, love and it's so funny like how they love each other yeah. mm -hmm. but then how they love true legend it's amazing you're you're working on a special so you both are working you're still working on music yep. and all of your shows yep judy with all of her businesses and you have a special yeah, yeah we got a baby special so it kind of starts the way you say once upon a time and i'm holding him and then i tell the story welcoming the newest edition of brett love judy <laughs> oh, God, I wish you could feel it. We are having a baby. It's crazy. <laughs> this is our baby. True legend, Harry's too Oh, he's so cute, beautiful. 